Ugh. Yes, rip, Sid. I didn't get fish fast enough or uh, good enough fish for his liking. <laughs> Alright, this is Albrook. How are you doing today, Tess? How's your, uh, the new content for the space game? some money while you're doing whatever it is you need to do. <coughs> Dancing girls, troops having beverages. Those were the days. It sounds like a fun, like, strategy, kind of relaxing type game. And depending on how you like to play, it can be, you know, you and I could have a completely different experience, which is neat. type stuff. Can, can, can I go back there? Okay, it's just single player. Cool. Well then, by all means, blow everyone up. That's the way you want to roll. Upstairs is definitely heating up a bit, which is unfortunate. And I'm still coughing a bit. Well, today for some reason. But, uh, but yeah. Otherwise, it's going great. 20 years, really? Oh, uh, yeah, I'd never heard of it, so. Smitten image, huh? But yeah, I'd never heard of it, so. It's, it's definitely interesting. Lots of lore. I can imagine there's lots of books about it. Let's 
that's, that's not Congrats on beating uh, Castlevania today. I was impressed that you finished it all in one uh, in one day. Some of that stuff is definitely challenging. Escape. Okay. I wonder if I should be just in the back row. Where he died. <clears throat> oh gosh. Um, maybe I put her in the back row with a, a flail or something. Because like that wasn't really doing that much. Brainstorm. Try this. Let's see what happens. Can I buy some potions? I wonder why they're all the way to the bottom. Zen! The serpent trench used to be deep underwater. Now it's above sea level. Sweet! Challenge my pot even. Yeah, it's 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 definitely a challenge challenge. Um But yeah, it's it's so much fun. The music is so good, the fights, the bosses, just I don't know, everything is everything is just real, real good about that that game. It's one of my favorites. And like I said, that was another one I'm pretty sure I had. That I just don't know where it went. <laughs> Unfortunately. It's Summon! Is he holding up a house? Oh. How long do you need? Exactly six minutes. Alright then. thing here is I can't use uh, on a fire. I can't use runic because I don't have a, a wreck of that sword. <clears throat> I guess I could just use uh, elemental or just basic attacks. Yeah, that was awful. I'm getting real sick of these timers. Oh, dang it. Uh, I meant to use, uh, was there a regular attack? Hey, Farnsey, what's up, dude? How was your day? Still snow in there? <coughs> One sec, Tuss. Timer, you know. You know. Yeah. Today still pretty cold. It was 83 degrees Fahrenheit here today. Today was our warmest warmest day of the year so far. <coughs> it's nice getting an extra attack with the black belt. I'm glad I put that on there. Hyper wrist. <coughs> Jeez. Hermit crap. 
Oh god. Find this kid real fast. Maybe I can get the treasure here. After. It's right there! Maybe not because there's four of them. Dang it! I'm afraid to open the other boxes because I don't want them to be, uh... Monsters. I didn't know that could be a thing. They just had to disappear one by one. They could have all just gone at the same time. Did I even get an item? No. Hey, bud. Let's go. <laughs> I just go the same way. That's gonna be cut way too close for me. is the Terrans, created and sent out AI, uh, terraforming fleet to create Earth-like planets later they send order to self-destruct except four. Others should refuse the order and start self-upgrading. Interesting. Eventually to the point where they created other ships and started their own goal of wiping out everything. Somewhere, stumbled into an ancient jump gate that connected other civilizations and a whole bunch of other lore that I won't go into. The Terrans are bad. Interesting. Yeah, that was uh, that was some uh, some good RNG right there. Not getting an encounter, so we're off to a good start tonight. Sabin, you're alive. Yes, yeah, sir. Thanks for holding the house for me. I appreciate it. A minor thing like the end of the world. Can 
You can actually come with me. <coughs> Let's go! Ugh. Stupid cough, man! Suplex Kepka. Not Smash. He doesn't even know. <laughs> what a joker. I only have one ribbon. <laughs> this is kind of close to a ribbon. He'll be using like Fire Dance and Horrible. I think those are both magical. God, I'm so frustrated with my cough right now. <laughs> like all day, nothing. I'm just looking at the uh, pluses here. <laughs> Yeah, man. I'm, I'm gonna go through the whole series, for the most part. <laughs> so yeah, 7 is on the uh, on deck. The original 7, not the uh, remake. Which, sorry Farnsey, all the crying babies you had to, to listen to today about the remake. So annoying. Yeah, it's gonna be awesome. I can't wait. Most of the games like this one I haven't played in so long that, you know. <sighs> Man, some sprint shoes would be a uh, real nice right about now, but. <sighs> um, I mean, I'm gonna try to do. Like, seven? I've never beaten Ruby and Emerald Weapon. I really like to beat those. Just like, as a personal thing. I've fought them multiple times. Um, and stuff like that, but... I mean, I'm not gonna like 100% it or anything, but... I'd like to do some stuff like that. I don't have any like... I don't know, like... I can't think of the word right now. Um, I don't know. Yeah, for sure. See if, you know, now that I'm older and can actually think about things, um, maybe I could actually do it. They said the trench was to the east, right? Yeah, I don't have any, like, incentives or anything to do certain things in games. Like, I could have set some stuff up and maybe should have, but I didn't. So, what else? Just do what I feel like doing. Like, I thought about trying Omega when I was doing Final Fantasy V, but there was no way. I would have had to farm, or like, I mean, there, there were cheese strats that I found out afterwards. World of Ruin version O. Just the black and white sadness. I wonder if the Serpent Trench... They said it was to the east. Hopefully it wasn't in the town. Yeah, definitely. Hey, Lord, what's going on, dude? How you doing? Yeah. There's all sorts of like strats and stuff, so I'm sure I can I can find something. So I am determined to beat them. Nessosaur. These are the guys that ran away. Let's see if I can suplex one before he runs away. 
Oh no, yeah, the world has come to an end, almost. A bad political joke? I'd keep the politics out of it, if it's to bash one side. Yeah, definitely. Rick. I'm gonna have to crack open the cough surf again tonight. Oh boy. Um, I've only played like a few hours of uh, Final Fantasy VIII, Gabriel, so that'll be a basically blind run for me. Um, I've played 9, I've played 10, I've played 7. I haven't finished. I have this thing where I'll start a game, I'll get to like where we're doing side quests, and then I just like for some reason stop playing. So I didn't actually beat 9 and 10. Um, I haven't decided, I think I'm going to do X2, I'm pretty sure. And then I'll do 13 and 15 for sure. I don't know if I'm going to do 13, 2 and re Lightning Returns. So, I don't know. I heard Lightning Returns was real bad. Oh, and 12. Yeah, 12 for sure. I haven't done... I haven't... I've played a little bit of 12, but like hardly anything. Okay, cool. Am I going the correct way to the Serpent Trench? I feel like I might have taken a wrong turn. Back at, uh... Whatever town that was. We've gone pretty far east already. And I haven't run into the Serpent Trench. And the Serpent Trench was... In a cave before. I like 8 now. Okay. Is it way over here? Can't be way over here, can it? Alright, we'll go over here if it's not here. Look, a buffalo axe. Yeah, the remaster looks really nice. I was talking about that with somebody else, uh, I think earlier this week, how 7 didn't really age well. Um, in terms of, like, it's hard to make remastered HD polygons look good higher definition rounded shapes, you know? So, but yeah, A looks really nice. So I'm, I'm really excited to play that. And um, I know there's a way to kind of break the game with uh, playing cards early and doing stuff like that. I'm not going to do that. Yeah, that little monster on the bottom? That's not a lizard. Gosh, man. Let's see if these guys are weak to fire. They look like plants. Why is that thing on the bottom? Oh, those things have no health. Alright, little buddy. Bye, goodbye. Bye. Seven is king, but eight and nine do look much better. They've aged much better graphically. But seven is just, like you said, it's king. It's, uh, we're all, the, we're not all, but most, a, a lot of nostalgia. These guys are weak to fire. Get a casual eight on Twitch and broke it first disc. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Like, I kind of want to enjoy it. My first, like, real time through, like, as it was meant to be, <clears throat> and kind of be, you know, be challenged by the bosses and stuff like that if I can be. Um, so I don't know. I watched, I've watched people get do the card stuff, and you spend so much time playing cards in the beginning, so much. Yeah, no, 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 I know, you don't need to see content, you just sit there and play cards until you get certain stuff you need, and you can turn the cards into, like, items and stuff. I've seen, like, how it works and, and stuff like that. Oh, show. How was your, uh, you were playing Earthbound earlier? How was that going? That's another game I've never played. Please tell me this is the, the trench. Earth 
I'm heading towards the trench. Can never keep a casual run going. You just get bored. Oh, you were saying that earlier. You play uh, these ones and then you start playing a game with better graphics at some point. Scheduled. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that's one I've never played. I've watched it, people play it. I've seen it like on uh, the Awesome Games Done Quick. I've seen that, like that kind of stuff. Oh, so I was like... I was on the Serpent Trench as I was walking, because they said it was above ground. Yeah, it's supposed to be amazing. I heard people either, like, just love it, or they just think it's so weird they can't get into it. Don't know if it carries over if you're fresh at 36. Yeah, I, that's like Ocarina of Time for me. I don't know. I just, I don't know. Two fire and poison. So this is fight and magic, so let's do that so it's like a better balance than just the earrings. running into a boss and not having a being able to use runic to be honest. Let's check the Esper's real fast. Oh she's done with that one. Sweet. Um, yeah we'll finish that one because she doesn't have fire two for some reason. So let's give her back the uh, the break blade so we can use runic again. It's interceptor Oh, no it's not. Interceptor clones. The Interceptor imposters. Someone's coming. <coughs> woof. Woof. Can we explore a little bit before we go in there? Let's down. Oh, is this where... Yeah, this is where we did that little side quest with the letters. Everything looks different now, though. Like, the entire bottom half of the town is gone. This is where we could sleep for free. I don't know if we still can. Oh, cool. At least that's still there. So we have this um, like mobile evap cooler in the garage. I decided to bring it upstairs today because it was getting warm up here. And I had it running for a little while in the in here before stream. It's a pretty big thing. It's sitting in the corner right here. But like it was nice, you know, when I sat down, especially when it was on. It's just pretty loud. I didn't want to have it on during stream, but it's already getting started to get toasty in here again, unfortunately. It's kind of annoying. We just really want to try to avoid uh, turning the air conditioning on. I mean, it's only April. Hopefully, you know, we can keep it off until like May, because then, for 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 us in Arizona, it's like straight, like June, July, August, most of September, you have the AC on, and it gets expensive. The electric any electric bill is expensive. But then we also haven't used the heat for a long time, so it's been... Wait! Who is it? Tara! I kind of like how we're going around finding all of our party members in different towns. Like, we just exploded and went all over the world. <laughs> so glad to see you. You're not coming with us? What do you mean you're not coming with us? The 
crap, Tara! Your parents are gone. Wayne and Katarin. Oh, they're just kids. <laughs> R.I.P. D. That is I. Boom! 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 Dang, that's sad. Why do I want to watch it? Come on! Don't do me like that. Can we just 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 say it? And we heard it. Protect the children. And the dog. Okay, that, I mean, like, that was just bad luck. That wasn't like it targeted the parents or anything. Oh, yeah, if you didn't notice, I wasn't wearing a hat tonight. I actually, you know, was able to get my hair in some sort of working order. Plus, the hat also makes it warmer in here for me. Like, my back is sweating. It's like, I think it's like 75 up here. It's like not that hot, but... I don't know. I have a ceiling fan on. I just get warm easily. I think that's a guy thing. My wife was up here today in like long sleeve shirt, and she was like, I'm not hot at all. Yeah, 75 is too warm. But I'm not turning the AC on. Like. I could turn this cooler back on, but it's too loud. It's just... It's not worth it. Anybody who's ever had an evap cooler in the house or a portable one, it also has that, like... It's not, like, a musty smell, but it's, like... There's a specific smell that comes with the evaporative coolers. So I don't know, maybe that, that that contributed to my cough acting up a little bit. I don't know. It could have. <laughs> yeah, I can't either. Like, I barely sleep under any, like, sheets or anything in the summer. Okay, well, I uh, guess we'll leave here. To just be a butt. <sighs> what's uh, what's the temperature get there in the summer, Farnsey? Uh oh, Food and Baba's coming. What up? The five bowl from. It's like Shrek. Ancient demon who was released when the world was undone. Oh yeah, ancient fatty. Morphin time. That means it's like comparable to like 90s here. In the, the old Fahrenheit measurement. Cool, well. Later. Oh, okay. I was like, what am I supposed to do? Because Terra. Oh, now we gotta fight this? Can we actually do damage though? Let's see if I can suplex him. Nice. Can we do it? Hell yeah, we can. <laughs> Alright. 
Let's just runic and suplex all day. Check. What is 36? 36 96.8. That is rather toasty. Anything over, like, honestly, anything over, like, 85 for me, almost like 80 for me is just too warm. Like, 90s suck. 100s are even worse. But you know, it happens. We get the like the best winters in the world pretty much. But unfortunately it's almost over. Like between like December and April, like December, like end of November, December, January, February, March, we get like we get like a solid four to five months of like really amazing weather. Doom did on, um, is she really not going to come with us on those, those, those ladies on the floating continent, those naughty, naughty monsters, that's what they were called, for real, terror, okay, hold on, hold the phone, actually, let me save it, I haven't saved it in a while. I haven't saved this since I got sobbing. Yikes. You guys are supposed to help me remember to save. She, she's really not coming with us? <clears throat> Hold on. Let me talk to her again. Let me talk some sense into her. Time to get out of bed, it's time to go to school. Oh my gosh. What did he say? I'll have you if something happens to Mama. This sounds like a creepy horror movie. Alright, dude. Well, it's been real. But I guess we're uh, heading on out. Tara, good luck with your life. Uh, 
Oh yeah, give me all them sleeping bags. Ooh, hey yo. You know what? <coughs> as much as I want to use one of these, I think I want to try to finish uh, leveling up the Esper so that I can put X Zone or uh, Fenrir on to Celis or something like that. Um, so I guess we walk down the coast. That's a pretty well hidden uh, Chocobo forest. Solid 12 health on those guys, or 10 or something. Weird. Weird, weird, weird. So I'm guessing we go north up the, the coast here. I could open the window. It's probably cooler outside right now. Let me do that real fast. I'm like sweating right now. One sec! Yes. All right, there we go. <laughs> All right, windows open. Hopefully that helps a bit. Okay, solid gain level. Eight hundred forty-four gear. So, how's everybody holding up with your uh, your quarantine stuff? Everyone doing okay? Anyone need anything? Just let me know. Anyone needs to talk? I feel like a couple days this week, like, the working from home has been really nice, but a couple of days I just like, I don't know, I miss my normal routine, and uh, I don't know, I feel a little just like sluggish trying to get my day going, and kind of have to force myself to do a few things to kind of get going. But, I don't know, like, today I was kind of feeling that, like, middle of the morning, and I took my laptop outside, and I did a little, did a little bit of, of work in the backyard. And, uh, so that, that kind of helped me, like, feel a little productive, so I wasn't just, like, cooped up sitting around all day. But hopefully everyone's doing okay, you're getting everything you need, supplies-wise. And, uh... Like, mentally, you're in good spots. Because... It can definitely be frustrating. Uh, I know, you know, I do know some people that are out of work right now, unfortunately, so... It's definitely stressful times and weird times. Feels weird, man. So... Stay strong. Everyone keeps saying it's gonna get worse before it gets better. Um, I'm just waiting for the, the worst to happen so we can start getting better. That would be fantastic. Because as it stands right now, um, I, 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 mean, I think we have at least three more weeks for my work of working from home, which just sounds crazy. It's, I think this is the third week. We're, cur we're currently in the third week, so... It'll be we're looking at six weeks, maybe even eight weeks, like two months working from home. That's that's crazy. Alright, you good. 
I guess we can give him Zone C. Might as well give him stuff while we can before we start getting bogged down with too many characters and stuff. Alright, opening the window is, has helped a little bit, so hopefully it keeps getting a little bit better. What's the temp outside? It's probably like 67? 66? Maybe? 68? Hey, 67, I was right. Yeah, today was 82. Fortunately, uh, beginning of next week, it's supposed to go back down a bit. So we were at 83 today, 80 tomorrow, 81 Saturday, 80 Sunday, and then we're back down to 79, 78, 74, 64, 66. So we still got a couple. Winter still has a couple cool days left, even though we're into spring now. Spring still has a couple cool days left. It's not ready to let go yet. All right, I'm gonna walk up this way, and hopefully this is the right way. All right, Buffalax, you getting suplexed? Cause I feel like it. You're in the wrong place at the wrong time. Dang it! Didn't quite do it. I think I went to all three of the places that at least I can only see three places on the uh, middle bottom continent island area. What the heck is that? I'll take it. I think we're using a break blade right now. Not really sure what that, uh, that magical cast was. Sleeping bags? Ah, oh, yeah. Loom Pieter. And the crazy lizard. I think it was a good choice to walk. Okay, why does it just look like it looks like a little froggy type thing? Yeah, I actually did my hair today. Main, what's up, noobs? How you doing? Uh, the main reason for me was uh, because the hat was uh, like increasing my body temperature. It was making me warmer. So, but yes, I have hair. It's just getting long. Like I've tried to do like. Like trim my bang or not my my bangs. I don't have bangs. Uh, <laughs> my sideburns kind of like trimmed up the, the the my back of my neck and like the hair that grows down to my neck just to kind of feel like a little bit better. But my hair just starts to get like real thick. Like I don't know, it just like grows layers or something. The peach fuzz. I I, I don't know. I grow hair. You can see my facial hair it grows it decently. <laughs> yeah, sick bangs, bruh. Hey, Valencia, what's up? Thank you for the host. I appreciate you. Yeah, sick bangs. I hate bangs. I, I, my personal opinion, she shaved the sideburns all the way up to the top. Now I'm good. Get some chops. Ugh. Um, my opinion. Nope, I did not. I did not save Sid. I continued on with the quest. We're just grieving a little bit still. Uh, so, yeah. Sid is still in his banana suit, motionless. Kind of like a hard banana now. An unripened banana. Yikes. Grow them efforts out? No way. My hair, once it gets past a certain length, uh, starts to curl. I found this out when I was in high school. I kind of started to grow my hair out when I was a senior in high school. Not a great decision. Um, yeah. Looking like a thin Elvis. 
wasn't Alvis thin to begin with. So look, looking like a regular Alvis. <laughs> Shave the sideburns. Uh, but anyways, yeah, I am not a fan of bangs on girls. I don't know why it was. I fortunately it's not a thing like it was in the '90s with those like big bangs, like big bangs. Those things were nasty. Sorry, just opinion for me. Never been a fan. So dang long. I'm freaking offended. Well, you were offended when... Who was I trash-talking that one night? One of the monsters. And you took offense to that. I can't remember what it was. <laughs> that was funny. I don't. I can't remember what monster it was or what boss it was. You're like, it's not his fault. You better apologize for that. All right, this was not the right way to go, apparently. Well, there's still another town up here, so I guess I can check it real fast. I have bangs, but I come in recently. They go down under my eyebrows. <coughs> Like, for me, like, when the female population has bangs that are, like, short enough to where it's just, like, here, and not long enough to, like, they can put it to the side, that's where I'm just kind of like, uh, eh, not a big fan. Not a big fan of the, like, the long hair and then the bangs that go to hair. I just, I don't know. I don't know why. Just, just never been my thing. Sorry, Tuss. <laughs> oh, he's just got a little ways to go on that one. Trust me, when I grew my hair out, I had bangs, kind of too, and I'm disgusted with myself now. Can we use Cure on this? Like Chelsea styled mohawks. White oats confirmed no bangs. That is for damn sure. Got the mohawk with the whole bangs thing? Yeah. Yeah, she does not have bangs. I mean, technically, we all have bangs, right? Like, what is the definition of bangs? Is it just the hair in the front, front of your head? Or is it when hair goes down here? Because if it's just the hair in the front of your head, then we all have bangs, but. Like, long bangs that go down to here? Nope. Especially when it's just like a straight line across. Yeah. Yeah. Gross. Get out of here with that. Alright, where we be? Nikkei. We talking noun or verb? Bangs can be a verb? Like, I'm go- Oh, we're talking about the noun. Like, the hair. Not like, to bang. Like, or banger. Or bangers and mash. Uh, man. I didn't realize how many forms of bang there could possibly be until just now. These are the conversations that we have here, guys. Like, you know, we enlighten each other. We make each other better people. Are bangers and mash... What's the bangers and bangers and mash? Because mash is just mashed potatoes, right? Is bangers sausage? I know it's an, <laughs> an Irish thing, right? Sausage? Yeah, I was right. Cool. If that was a trivia question, I would have nailed it. I think I learned that from uh, Luck of the Irish, that one Disney Channel original movie back in the day. Anybody knows what I'm talking about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Never heard of banger sausages. Are the sausages that just sing and they make real cool music when you eat them? Or is it screaming? I don't know. It's an, it's an Irish thing, right? I believe. But I've been utilizing other relics. I mean, I guess I can put them on when I'm in towns and stuff, but... When I'm walking across the continent, I guess I don't need them. That sounds terrible. Well, earring... In, while I'm in town...
But I'm not gonna use sprint shoes when I'm just walking around on the the overworld map. Just like uh, there's another one, another what is it? Something pudding? Black and white pudding or something like that? Which I think is just pork sausage and blood sausage? It sounds terrible, but uh, like, like I said, I also learned this from watching that movie. A Rune Edge Enhancer? What is that? Yeah. <laughs> Look it up! Black and white, or black and white pudding, I think? I don't have auto sprint, yo! Was that in your game too? Welcome... What? What are you... What, Saucy? What's wrong? You just came in during an Irish food talk. We're talking about the uh, luck of the Irish. Enhancer increases mag. I've actually eaten blood, like, like, co uh, uh, like coagulated. I've seen it on uh, cooking shows and, like, um, the, like, the, the shows where the guys travel around the world and eat random stuff. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. They just, like, I'm sure it tasted super metallic-y. But, good iron, uh, or you just like down it real fast. You don't even, you don't even know what it tasted like. Ooh, diamond dust. Why is it so expensive? I mean, I guess it's made of diamonds, but you know. You know. How's it going, Saucy? How was, uh, Animal Crossing? And you're decorating. Oh, you didn't know! Oh, gosh. You are now a vampire. You don't even know it. Like, man, this tofu is actually not bad. That's, a uh, <coughs> blood? Ooh. It's called blood pudding. White and black pudding is when you mix vanilla and chocolate pudding. <laughs> That's the yin-yang pudding. Like, I could have swore it's just blood pudding. Okay. Oh god. That's funny. You mix vanilla and chocolate in a swirl. <laughs> Ready for more action again, though? Yeah, I'm sure. Like, there are days where you feel like you want to just chill out and relax. Relax on a cool shooting some b ball outside of school and do your Animal Crossing. Uh, and then there are days where you just want to, you know, kill some stuff. Yeah, vamp or a vampire chat. Got that glittery skin. We talk about glittery, glittery skin vampires, or like vampires that just kill you. Real vampires, or like Hotel Transylvania, Dracula. What kind of vampires are we talking? Yeah, the good kind. The good kind. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get that glitter out of here. I'm here to suck. Come to the right place, Farnsey. Come to the right place. On Thursdays we suck. Something like that, right? Yo, what's up in movie with the old dude? That was very general, noobs. Hail to the night. We taken the offering this evening. Fangs out, people. To the next. I was like a snake. And when he goes to feed the woman, it sounds like a straw? What? Was that supposed to be like, like a, a comedy type vampire movie? Lamau. Oh, opening the window has helped so much. Thank you guys for that recommendation. He was in Naked Gun. Oh, oh, Leslie Nielsen? That guy? Um, gosh, I don't know what movie that was, but that's the actor who uh, played him. Yeah. I've been chatting with the boss of this gang, Gerard. Kind of name is Gerard. That sounds familiar. Like, he did a lot of just like, um, what are the movies called where they make fun of other movies? A spoof type movies. 
like all those Naked Gun movies. Um, he's very like Mr. Magooish. We'll enter the castle through a secret cave that only we knows about. Dang. Okay. All right. Vamos. Great noobs. Dracula dead and loving it. I feel like I've seen that scene where he drinks with a straw. That was the title. All right. Hell yeah. Just a follow this homie now. Uh, after you, gentlemen. Have you heard of ladies first? Are we just taking the boat, or...? The Crimson Robbers. Can I go with you guys? Uh, okay. He tries to get the chick to come outside using a vampire controlling. <laughs> that just sounds like one of those ridiculous movies. The staircase to nowhere. That was a waste of resources, guys. Just a waste. Is there like another door in here, maybe? Ooh, Figaro Castle Prison. Where's your boss? Yeah, I know. Is there a back door to this place? Let me in the back door, please. Yes, you! No! Go in the closet! <laughs> yeah. That's, uh, that's my, uh, my, my life's motto, Tuss. Be careful who you let in the back door. <laughs> Gord. Oh, is that the scene? I will watch that soon. <laughs> Fair enough. That will not make a compilation video, but uh, it'll be a it'll be a funny clip for sure. Well, where the heck do I go? Where's the boss? Where's the boss man, Gerard or Gerard? Hello, team. Yeah, we're a little off the... Where did that even start? I don't know. It makes it that much better though, right? If the clipping actually loads. By the time it loads, it's gonna be like 10 minutes later. Oh, bangs. Oh yeah, bangs, bangers, and mash. Somehow vampires got into the mix. Hey, you know. Whatever works. Hey, there he is. Oh, that looks like Edgar. Oh, I get it. I get it. It's an anagram of Edgar. Clever, clever boy. Or clever girl. I don't know. For you Jurassic Park fans. Bangs with the sausages. Eating blood to vampires. It's a pretty pretty uh, standard progression. Bangs turned into Leslie Nielsen. Pretty standard. I mean, I don't know what other path you could go after bangs. Obviously, it's sausage. Did he go? I, which way did he go? Did he go north or south? I'm gonna check the boat again because I wasn't watching. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yep. Oranges. He's talking to oranges right now. Yep. Yep. Okay. Yep. Okay. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Poor guy. I'm busy getting ready for our departure to Figaro. Don't play possum with me. He's wearing different clothes and everything. Get R rated tonight. Hold on to your butts. I like it. I always say that whenever my wife takes a turn too fast. Oh yeah, he's just just letting his, his bangs hit his face. God, that sounds awful. How would anybody want that? Hold on to your butts. 
We also, uh, my wife put on Space Jam earlier than today when she was eating her eating lunch, and the guy, the uh, Frank, what's his name? His name is Pod Stan Podolak in uh, Space Jam, but what's the the hacker dude's name in Jurassic Park? Ah uh, ah uh, ah! Uh. You didn't say the magic word. What's his name, Barnsey? I know you know it. Newman. Yeah, Newman. He's in Space Jam. He's uh, he's Michael's like personal assistant guy. Yeah, keep the flies out of your eyes. That's what that's what eyelashes are for. Ned tree. Boom, boom. They see me rolling. What up, Valencia? You see, I put on the sprint shoes just for you. Oh, Newman is Seinfeld, you're right. It sounded right. It's Nedry? Really? I believed you. Abrasive secret... Secretive... Laos? PJ Sugar. Hold on, let me watch this real fast. Is this the butt one? The butt clip? The butt one? Oh, God. Um... That's, uh, that's my, uh, my, my life's motto, Tuss. Be careful who you let in the back door. Hey. It's, uh, it's not a bad one to live by. <laughs> Is it real? Okay, hold on, let me look up the Jurassic Park real fast. I didn't even spell Jurassic right. I gotta find his name real fast. Oh, it's Dennis! Nedry's his last name. I was thinking of Dennis for some reason. I just remember, Farnsley, you said you always, like, that's one movie you can always, like, put on in the background and watch it wherever you... I'm not questioning you, I just wanted to know his full name. Banger Park? What is that? Is that an amusement park with just, like, mashed potato-themed rides? Oh, no, we, we just established Banger was, a uh, sausage. Sausage themed rides. That could be weird. Oh no, I don't want to leave. Still need to shop. No, 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 like, I, I, I just, when I was trying to think of his name, like, Nedry didn't even sound remotely familiar. And I've seen that movie a lot. I just, but I, I don't know, I guess I always do by Dennis. His sin as well? Is that a social security number? A student ID number? Yeah, if you got it. What's this blood type? Because, you know, we got a lot of vampires in here tonight. One might have hit the jackpot with that one. <laughs> yeah, we uh, we could all use a social security number in SSN tonight. Alright, let's, uh, let's go wander a bit. Yeah, we're out of control tonight, guys. That's all right. I'm much happier now that I opened the window. Gosh, that made a load of difference. Ooh, Evixa. It's out of control. Uh, 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 you didn't say the please. Oh, uh, 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 you didn't say the magic word. Uh, uh, uh. Doesn't really have the same effect when you read read the text. Uh, uh, uh. Sounds like a robot. You didn't say please. What are you guys doing? We have to stop. Hey, look, Magitek armor. Diamond shield, Rod's hat, green, and diamond. Diamond armor is real, real expensive. That was your favorite line from Newman? We talk about Newman now, we talk about Jurassic Park. I really didn't watch that much Seinfeld. You would see plays if you want to live. Okay, when you said Arnold, I thought of Arnold, the football head Arnold from Nickelodeon. That was my first thought. I don't know why. 
I watch that show a lot. Look, stick, stupid, stick, stupid, get, go get the stick. Oh, oh, look, stick, stupid, yeah, 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 the... I like that one, that one's funny, too. <laughs> he was drinking Jolt, too, right? What are your extinct? <laughs> that was my impression of that dinosaur. <laughs> Man, I always felt bad for him that scene, like, if the sign was just the right way, he could have got away. He could have made it. A stout spear and a gold lance. I mean, that'll be for, uh, Gerard when we get him back, but... Let's buy one, why not? Let it fly. YOLO, right? The world's kind of come to an end, so let's just buy it. Did you guys like, uh, the second and third one? I thought the second one was still pretty good. The third one was a little, eh. He shouldn't have been drifting then. You're right. Oh, he does get absolutely destroyed. I've never read the book. The books are by Michael Crichton, right? Is that right? Or am I just... There's another, here's another banger right here. <laughs> water, 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 water. Be God too intense. Let's see. Am I getting them mixed up? So the second one's with uh <coughs> what's his name's daughter? Oh that one wasn't as yeah, you're right. The third one is pretty good. Where they uh, find Alan, they say they're, you know, just doing a tour, blah, 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 they're super rich. And they find the, they want to find the kid on the island. That one's actually pretty good, you're right. Sound like a sinner, must be a sinner. Did I check that box? Can I check that box? You're right, the third one's pretty good still. Did you guys like the the new ones with Chris Pratt? William H. Macy is a legend. Jurassic World, didn't care much for Fallen Kingdom. I didn't like the second one because of that brontosaurus scene. Um, Duck is still alive and well. He's meditating just north of Narsh. But yeah, I like the first one. Second one. Bro. I don't even want to talk about that brontosaurus scene. That's like the first time like I've actually like been noticeably emotional in a movie. In a long goddamn time. My wife was like... Looking at me like, you, you okay? Like, she thought it was sad too, but like, I don't know. That one just... That one hit me different for some reason. So, I haven't seen that movie since. Yeah, the Indo-Raptor thing was kind of eh. Yeah, I mean, it kind of felt like the the one from the first movie too, the Indominus Rex or whatever. It just felt kind of similar to that. Like, okay, you guys are just gonna be creating a bunch of dinosaurs, like, like. Frankenstein dinosaur type deals, like it's just the same story again, kinda. And then the way we were like they were like gas in the dinosaurs, I was like, okay, come on now, I'm gonna turn this off real fast. 
if you, you know, if this continues. So, I mean, they, they left it open for a third one. I'm sure there's going to be a third one because there's money to be made. But uh, we'll see. But I like the first, the first new one. That one's enjoyable. Yeah, I guess. The second one was the... The one dude... Yeah. Yeah. I liked being in the park, though, again. That part was fun. That, that one's that's what's kind of fun about it. And the T-Rex freaking saves the day. Am I going here yet? It's a fairy ring. up here on the second floor of the... There's Jarad. What's up, dude? Let's go. Is anybody going to be watching uh, Onward tomorrow or this weekend? It comes out on Disney Plus tomorrow. It's Jurad. Currently, he's Jurad. He's having a midlife crisis. Um, it's called Onward. It's the the newest uh, Disney Pixar movie. You get rid of Disney Plus. You watch The Mandalorian, and then you uh, got rid of it. We watch Disney Valencia. So what? Come at me. Got Crunchyroll. I mean, if you watch a lot of anime, for sure. My wife's a Disney freak, so... I like a lot of this stuff, too. I grew up with that kind of stuff. <laughs> On Berserk and One Piece. I'm not sure what those are, to be honest. I'm not a big, like, I haven't watched a lot of anime. The ones I've watched, I've really enjoyed. Um, and I think it's more because I just don't know what to watch, or... I don't have Crunchyroll, either. And my, my co-worker uh, likes a lot of anime, and he recommended some stuff. But I just never got Crunchyroll, so... Yeah. Yeah. As long as I'm not an Inu Inuyasha hype fan. I've heard of Inuyasha, but I don't know what it's about. I don't know what it is. I've, yeah, I've never watched it. Ever. The only things I've ever watched are Sword Art Online, and uh, I've watched most of Attack on Titan. Um, and then I watched like two or three episodes of Fate's Day Night. And then I watched a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh! But that doesn't really count. Dog boy and his chick Kagome. Kagome? Kago? Kago. So we're heading towards the Figaro Cave now? Is that hopefully right here in the mountain? The only good part of that show is when the word sit is used. Why is that? Thanks. What? Oh, well, the miracle feels... What? Why is the funny part when he... when the word sit is used? I'm confused with these monsters. They're just the giving kind. Given type. Let's put my relics back on. Ribbon and I had black belt, which has been kind of nice. Let's take that off. I, don't, I wish 
add another ribbon. This is kind of close to a ribbon. It makes the lead Inuyasha slam it to the ground in a comedic fashion. Oh, I see. Oh, I see. Who are you? Siegfried. Pretty dangerous from here on. I'll go in first and clear out the monsters. You know who I am? I am General Celis. Is this one of the caves that we left treasure to get later? Probably not. Meaning probably I got the stuff already. Sprint shoes only make me run faster. They don't do anything for me in battle, do they? I don't see the point of use. Like, I understand running, like, faster, but being able to, like, use stuff to protect against status ailments, I feel like it's, it's stronger, isn't it? Is it not? Gotta suplex Dante first. I just don't feel like using sprint shoes. Five hours faster than normal time in sprint shoes. What? Ugh. That math doesn't even make sense. Five times a million viewers is a lot. Damn, Barnsley, I'll split that million with you. 500 million apiece. I mean, 500,000 apiece. Maybe I'm not trying to beat the game in a world record time. This isn't a speed run. See, it didn't help. I still encountered it. You record it, people will come back and watch the replays. Put on a pair of Heelys? I would do that. Hell yeah, Oats. You the, you the real MVP. I try. I try. I still haven't put anything on YouTube yet, like, stream my full streams. I actually, I moved some to another hard drive to clear up some space. Expulsion. Maybe I did leave stuff in here for later. If you stream it, they will come. Yeah, I, I definitely plan on it. I need to uh, edit some of them a little bit to cut off, like, the intro and some of the breaks and stuff that I've taken so that it's, like, one solid segment. Yeah, definitely. I'm totally, yeah, I'm, that's the main reason I want to put them on there. That is to get them off my hard drive. Nice, dude. Yeah, I've been kind of procrastinating a little bit with that. I should just, like in the morning, just, just start one and just, I don't know, start doing it, you know? Just get it going. All we fight are Dante's. Sooner the better. I haven't even been streaming for a year. Don't don't tell me that. Come on. Don't be mean. Yeah, it definitely happens. I mean, I feel like I've gotten into a, a pretty decent rhythm with the, uh... Um... With my, uh, clips and stuff like that, so... That, that one's not too bad for me, and then making the, the, like, compilations and stuff hasn't been too bad. The first, the first one, and even the second one, took quite a while, but then... Like I said, I kind of got into a rhythm and kind of 
know what to do with that stuff, so it's a lot. I mean, and then uploading to YouTube just, I don't know, it's just a matter of waiting. I didn't go in that door down there, dang it. So, Neck Hunter. Why? What is that? Look, it's E.T. again. I would like to keep my necks, sir. You get, think he just has a bunch of necks in that bag that he was holding? It's like Santa Claus, but instead of presents, it's just necks. No thanks. Just a bag of skin necks. Ugh, God. Leather jokers? Come on, Tuss. <laughs> what? Oh, she finished it, finally. I want to get her Fenrir now. Yo. What else do you do with skin next? That is a great question. Would anybody in chat like to answer that? Oh, this is where I started from. That's a bam. Vampiric or vampiric? What's the proper term? <coughs> Leather chokers out of necks? Like, what about a belt? Can you make a belt? Can you string some necks together? Not even a real world. Real word. I thought vampiric was a real word. That's a lot of stitching, that's for sure. You can use human hair while you're being all barbaric. Gross. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, I'll stop. Oh gosh. Yeah, my neck isn't that big, so I would be a lot. It's like a, I got like a 16 and a half inch neck, I think, something like that. What is that? Interesting. Yeah. You know what they say about guys with big necks. Takes a lot more neck skin to make a choker for them. That's what they. That's what they say. Yeah, yeah, of course. I'm not gonna use my own skin to make a choker. Yeah, wow. <laughs> I like turtles. What's in the other door that we didn't go in? <coughs> to make sure there isn't a chest that I... Humpty! My name is Humpty. that one. So that one we got the first time around.
Okay, let's go back. Are you excited to start Final Fantasy VII tomorrow, Farnsey? I'm stoked for you to start. Come here, little turtle. I've got treats for you. Or I'm just gonna jump. Alley oop. Streams? Yeah, it is. Damn it, dude. Did that wild ride? Yeah, me too. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'll have to check your uh, the Google Sheets again to see what you changed for that stuff. I've already taken, like by somebody else. All these neck hunters. Put back the necks. They don't belong to you. Trying to make an honest living. All right, Tess. All right. They won't die though. Maybe if I strangle them. <laughs> Tell the world of ruin. Yeah, they just ruin your neck. Ooh, what we get? Strangle the neck. Wind attack. Up, up, right, right, down, down. Okay, I can remember that. <coughs> I think I can remember that. If I can get out of this cave. Oh, we're in Figaro. He got all. Gerard, are you all right? Okay, son. It was awful. That guy was flapping his bangs all over my face. I couldn't stop him. Me too. <laughs> Me too. Such a such a headbanger, that's for sure. What was awful, sir? Everything was oh monsters in here? I Airblade sick Wah 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 Wrong juice Dang Tess, I'm proud of you for staying up so late. Did you take a nap today? Yes, we know. It was awful. You're muted. I was gonna say thanks for hanging. <laughs> thanks for hanging out for a while and talking about vampires and necks and bloods, blood and 
all that good stuff that goes along with it. It's been swell. I hope you... Hey, we got a gold shield from that. I hope you have a great night. Don't let the vampires bite. Something like that, right? Yeah. Something like that. Should I go to the middle door first? Thank you kindly. I appreciate it. Bye. We will see you next time. Talk to you on the discords. I think the middle door is probably like where we have to go, so let's go check around here real fast. Yeah. Yeah. Is that for... Dang. That's pretty good. That's pretty dang good. Alright. We can change our green beret, finally. Our green beret. Oi. Dang it! Dang it to heck. We're almost out of MP with Celis. Cause I've been wasting it! Oh, I am. Alright, cool. Be back. I hope there's a save point up here that I can, um... You know, there's probably something, like, upstairs.
didn't even hit it. Thank you. Sabre. Is that even a good thing? Not at all. Cool. Cool. Alright, well, I think we're done here. Does that mean all the monsters are gone? Nope. Definitely not. Yo, what up Anubis? How you doing, my man? How's life treating you? How's the Final Fantasy VII life? You recovered from your, uh... Uh, whatchamacallit, your... Intense... Shock from yesterday? Is Auto Crossbow still viable? Not really. Shell shocked after yesterday. Definitely. I think we all were once we went through that scene for the first time. But, uh, once you get a little time, you'll feel better. And, uh, just keep enjoying the crap out of the game. Like I said, I'm super excited to play it again. There's just so many little things that I don't remember about the game that, you know, when I, I'll run into it and be like, oh yeah, that's right. aspect of it. Are you finding just uh, like a lot of the boss fights pretty pretty tough? I mean it sounds like you're not really like super grinding which which is always fun. So if I go to one of the towers can I sleep for free? plan as well as I play through these games is not really like a lot of grinding so I'll probably be doing the same like I told I told the uh, chat earlier when I play Final Fantasy 8 I'm not gonna abuse the uh, the card game because there's a way that if you use the oh yeah if you uh, play a lot of cards you can kind of <coughs> make you can kind of break the game early on and make it easy which I'm not gonna do. All hail King Edgar, King Gerard. I wanna put him in the front so we can uh, bump 
buy stuff. Oops. A debilitator. Cast weak point randomly used. Just so I have it, I guess. Yeah, there's a card game in in eight. There's a card game in in nine too. One of them is I, one of them I remember is like pretty good, and then one of them I remember is not that great. But yeah, there's a there's there's cards you can play in eight. As like a side type side. A continuous side quest type thing, so sorry for the spoilers. But I mean you figure that out pretty pretty quick in the game. But yeah, there's there's a way that I've seen that like if you play like that you play a lot of cards, you can do something with the cards to make the game easier the beginning at least. What uh, what part of the game are you at right now, Anubis? Yeah, the summon materia, it's really cool. I like that too. Have you gotten quite a few so far? I'm sure you've gotten like the, the pretty standard like Shiva, Ifrit, Ramu. It's Ramu in 7, right? Not Quetzal... In one of the games, there's a different lightning summon. About seven. About seven. Oh, like about seven summon materia? Cool. Ramu, yeah, Ramu. Ifrit Shiva. Um Yeah. I don't remember which other ones you probably have, but um, now where do we go? Oh, we came up above, so we're in a different part now. Cool. I think there's a place to the right of us. Have you enjoyed the music a lot? The, uh, the boss music in that game is one of my favorites. Yeah, music's phenomenal. That's one thing that's held up in that game really well. Is that figure okay, or what is that? <laughs> Sorry about that. Earth was your healer. I'm sorry, dude. At least you can put healing material on other people, but you're gonna have to spend some time now leveling it up. Unfortunately. So what is this cave? Is this figure okay? Seems like it. So then this is not where I wanna go. South Bee Girl. So we were just there. <laughs> I wonder if, uh...
something else on this continent that if I can you know, just take figure out under the sand again. Oh yeah, I can jump. That's right. Oh my god, it's already 11:30. Dang. Been having a good a good time tonight. I'm a, I'm at huge material part in the game. What do you mean? A sand horse? Those are neat. That's probably gonna hurt. Well, the... Yeah, Edgar! Oh, story-wise, you had a big materia part? Cool. See, I, it's been so long since I played it, like, <laughs> I'm not even super familiar with what that part is. So wait, can I go back, like, under... hold on. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, I want to go to that place. Sup? Howdy, howdy, howdy. Ugh. I'm really glad that you're enjoying it, Anubis. Are you planning on playing um, 8 afterwards, or what's your plan after you finish? I know you're not going to be done for quite a while, but... Hey, what are you doing? Come on up. Come on. <coughs> Let's save it real fast. Trying to find the remake for a good price? Ah. Is that the main reason that you uh, wanted to play the original? Is so you could play the, the remake? I mean, it's probably what, like 50 bucks for the just like the base game without, uh, without the extra stuff. Did you play the, uh, the demo for, uh, the remake? Calling. What's up, lady? Last book. Yeah, I thought it was, I thought it was really good, too. The music, the graphics, everything was awesome. Um, I, it's gonna take me a little while to get used to the battle system for sure. So, just like the the limited amount of stuff that we got to do in the demo, it just wasn't enough time for me to kind of get used to. It's Setzer, Seltzer water. So I'll need, I'll definitely need more time to kind of figure out how I, how I like to play and that kind of stuff and what, I don't know, seems to work better because you can like dodge and stuff too, it's interesting. I kind of like this because it's making me use uh, characters. You're used to the ATB. What uh, what other games have you played that that you're used to it? I know uh, like 12 and and after that had that kind of gameplay, um, <clears throat> but I haven't really played any of those games. So I think I have another 
lozenge thing in here. Oh, the 12, okay. I was going to say, I played like a couple hours of 12, and that's how that one was, so. But I haven't played enough of it to really get used to it. So there you go. You're ahead of me in that sense. Let's go to Daryl's too. Uh, all right. I, whatever you say, Seltzer. Thanks for letting me know where it was, I guess. Something to finish it? I've heard a lot of people really like that one, so... I'm looking forward to getting back into it. Uh, the one that I have on PS2 is like the original one that came out. And I know some people have recommended buying or getting the, the like updated one. I can't remember what it was called, but... Yeah, people said recommended to get that. I didn't play 13, so I've, I've played a little bit of a 12. I haven't played any of the 13s uh, or 15. So I have no opinion. From people that I've talked to, about the 13 games, they've enjoyed 13 and 13 too, but not Lightning Returns. played the 2.8 remix on PS4, and then my wife and I have played like half of Kingdom Hearts 3, but we kind of got to a point where like we stopped playing for some reason, and then we just haven't, we haven't jumped back into it, unfortunately. What about you? Are you a big Kingdom Hearts fan? What do I have right now with him? I just have cards. I've got a lot of money. Randomly dispatches an enemy. Yeah, definitely. I would definitely start with the first one. That's probably still my favorite. Um, because it's just like... How do I explain it? It's more Disney-centered and focused. Um, with like the plot and this, you know, the storyline and that kind of stuff. I know plot and storyline are like the same thing, but... Um, <clears throat> definitely start with that one. And then I just work your way through the series. I think you could probably get away with just doing Kingdom Hearts 1, 2, and then going to 3, rather than playing any of the other ones. Because they do have some other ones with, that came in like that, like on PS4, the 2.8 remix. There were, there was one longer game, and then um, like a short, a shorter one. Because I know they did some stuff on, uh, I think it was 2DS, 3DS, Game Boy Advance. I don't remember what, what systems they were on. But, yeah. Are all of the games in the bundle? Or is it a bundle of the uh, earlier games? Is this better? Like, I'm gonna have Celis too. Does she have armor right now? She has gold armor? Should she even have armor? Oh wow. What's the what's the cost on that? 
that's definitely worth uh, worth picking up, in my opinion. <clears throat> and that one's more of like a like a Zelda style of fighting. It's more you're just running around, uh, hack, just like attacking stuff. You can use abilities and spells, but it's not like turn-based. You're just running, running around fighting. I think that's why my wife really enjoyed it, because it wasn't like real slow, like uh, Final Fantasy, with like the turn-based stuff. She always thought that was <coughs> really slow. I think we tried to play one, like one of them once, but. She just didn't really like, care for it too much. I guess I'll buy one of these. And one of these. On sale for 30? What? Is that on the PlayStation Store? Come with one and two, or like one and two and two point eight and one point eight and two point eight and three point eight. <laughs> I know they have like different ones. Like I can give them diamond shields too. The diamond shields are pretty inexpensive. of a deal, I would, I would buy that like in two seconds. I'd pay $30 for the first two games together. Yeah, that's an incredible deal. You know, a normal 60 bucks game price, so. <laughs> cool. That's really nice, though. A really nice, uh. A really, really nice deal. excited for you. You'll have to let me know when you get to the, the first uh, King of Hearts game. And that's still my favorite one to this day. I love that game. I probably played through it <clears throat> twice by myself and then once with my wife where we would just like, one of us would do one area and then we got to the next area we would just kind of switch back and forth. something that you just like heard about or heard about it in the game or so there's only one way to get it um 
Hey, what are you doing under there? Um. Have you done, uh, oh, your sister told you. Have you been to the Chocobo farm yet? Before, like, the Chocobo stalls and stuff? 